Good morning, dear Aries. Today promises to be an intriguing mix of cosmic energies, each bringing its own unique flavor to your day. As the moon moves into Leo, it activates your house of self-expression. What does this mean for you? Well, it's your time to shine brightly, and you might find yourself inspired to infuse a little drama and creativity into your personal style. Let your individuality radiate, and don't be afraid to be the true and authentic you. However, as is often the case in life, there are challenges to navigate. Mercury and Uranus are currently engaged in a celestial face-off, which can sometimes lead to bouts of stubbornness and unreasonableness. This influence doesn't only affect you, but also those around you. It's crucial to be aware of your communication style today. Approach conversations with diplomacy and make an effort to defuse any minor conflicts before they have a chance to escalate, especially when dealing with individuals who may be a bit more temperamental. As the day unfolds, the moon forms a harmonious alignment with Jupiter, bringing a positive and expansive energy into play. This is the perfect time to do something special for yourself, to bask in self-care, and to treat yourself with love and kindness. It's a moment to appreciate all that you are and all that you have. However, a small word of caution while indulging in self-love is wonderful, avoid going on a wild shopping spree in the name of retail therapy. Impulsive and extravagant spending might lead to regret later on, so aim for a balance between self-care and financial responsibility. In essence, today is all about celebrating your unique self, handling communication with care and empathy, and indulging in self-love without going overboard with your spending. Enjoy this day, Aries, and let your inner light shine brightly. Now for the question of the day. In your opinion, which zodiac sign do you think is the best at problem solving, and why? Share your thoughts and insights in the comments. Thanks for tuning in to According to the Stars. Subscribe and be sure to come back tomorrow to see your new reading.